Hi, I'm Graydon Blair from Utah Biodiesel Supply. We're talking about a product called Kill'em. Kill'em is an antibacterial product that kills any sort of organic matter living in biodiesel or diesel fuel or any sort of a uh, liquid, if you will. How strong is it? Well, it happens to be the strongest antibacterial product for fuel that's allowed by the EPA in the United States. That's how strong it is. This is the best you can get. You need to kill it, this'll do it. How does it work? Well, it's got this handy little dosing vial at the top that has graduations in 5, 15, and 30. Or you can also use a little beaker to do it as well. And let's talk about how much you'll use. For every 100 gallons of biodiesel that you need to treat as a preventative measure, you're gonna use about 22 milliliters. If you've got bio, biodiesel that's contaminated, you're going to treat it with the contaminated rate, which is 66 milliliters for every 100 gallons. Now, how do you know if you have a, tree, uh, a bacteria growing in your fuel? If you pull off your fuel filter and you see a slime on the top of it, or you open your tank and there's just this snotty looking slime in there, there's a chance that's a bacteria product growing. And so you want to treat it as quick as you can. What do you have to treat? Unfortunately, you have to treat everything. Everything from the container that that first oil came into, any pumps that you have used, any containers in between, clear to the tank on your truck. Treat it if you detect you've got bacteria. Where does bacteria grow? Most of the time, we see bacteria problems growing wherever there is humid, hot air. Where is that typically? Along the coasts of the United States, down in the Gulf region, up in the New England area in the summers, and also in the winters. If it gets hot and humid, remember bacteria likes warm, it likes dark, fuel tanks are dark, there's a good chance it can grow. One of the important things to know about Killam is where bacteria grows. Bacteria is growing in a water phase in your liquid, biodiesel, vegetable oil, diesel fuel, whatever you have. So if you suspect that you've got a, an organic bacteria growing in there, you got a water problem as well. So you wanna make sure and dry that oil every time you bring it in. Bacteria loves water. Killam is only going to treat bacteria in the water phase of a liquid. So if you have perfectly dry diesel fuel, it ain't going to do it. But if there's water in there and the bacteria is growing, this will do it. If you have bacteria, it's a really big indicator that you've got water in your process somewhere. Get rid of it. We have a really cool dry pro nozzle. Learn a little bit more on our website, utahbio.com, we can explain that. But again, if you have bacteria growing in there, you've got water. How do you get rid of it once you've got it? Well, if you run into a bacteria problem, treat it with Killam immediately. Treat every container, clean the containers after you've treated and drained everything out. That even includes the fuel filter on your vehicle. That's everything along the way. Then go ahead and uh, put fuel back in it. And then what we recommend is that you use the preventative measure, uh, the preventative dose every time that you dose that fuel. Killam is available in a 16 ounce bottle. We also sell it in a two, a four pack. You can get it by the case. We can ship it pretty much anywhere in the United States. It's got these handy graduations down the side. These are 16 ounce bottles. Uh, they've got uh, ounces on one side and milliliters on the other for dosing it out. We have used it for years. We've sold it for years. We have customers that absolutely swear by it. If you even suspect you've got an organic organism growing in your fuel, we highly recommend treating it with Killam. Now, can you treat the vegetable oil as well? Absolutely. This is an antibacterial product. It'll kill it in the oil. Once you've killed it in the oil, you may notice that slime or that stuff rise to the top. You want to scoop it off and get rid of it and again, clean the tank. But if you've got a problem with bugs and you want to kill it, kill them is what you want. Stop by our website, Utah Bio Diesel. It's at utahbio.com to learn more about it and also subscribe to our other videos to learn more about our great products on our website. Thanks for watching.